The Unity animator is great, but sometimes it feels like it's working against you, especially when you're working with sprite sheets. If you'd prefer to keep your animation logic entirely in your code, this video is for you. Introducing Crossfade. This lovely function will transition to a new animation state of your choosing the moment you call it. No more mysterious delayed transitions, no more animator spider webs with endless substates, and no more triggering your OCD trying to get the damn lines to travel along the grid. All that's required is the animations you wish to use are in the animator. They don't need to be connected, just there. The function takes three arguments, the name of the state you want to play, the transition time from the current state to the new one. As I'm using a sprite sheet here, I want immediate transitions and the animation layer, which will always be zero if you're using this strategy. If I place this in my start method and press play, you'll see it takes effect. We can improve the performance by int hashing the state string using this static method. Here I've hashed all the animations I'd like to use. Let's just experiment with idle and walk for a moment. You'll see how easy it is to transition the moment you want without any external guesswork or animation fiddling. To manage the full animation flow, I employ what I like to call the firewall pattern. We're basically going down a list of conditions until one is satisfied and we use that state. I place the most vital ones ordered by importance up the top. Lock state just delays state changes for a while. This ensures things like the attack animation finishes or the landing animation plays for at least a few frames. To put it all together, in update, we're getting the frame state, returning if we're running it already, then perform the crossfade. Remember, if you're using 2D IK animations or standard 3D animations, add some extra time to the transition for smoother blends. And that's how you animate like a programmer. If you like this workflow and want to take it even further, check out Animancer. It expands on this concept and offers a bunch of sexy features. Link down below. Like the video if you found this enjoyable and tell me literally anything you'd like in the comments as I read every single one of them. Ciao.